Well, let me tell you a little story about Franklin D. Scruff. Times were pretty hard. Life was rough. He threw it all away for a shot at some shiny stuff. Say a prayer for Franklin D. Scruff. for Franklin D. Scruff. Well, Frankie's mama didn't like him as much as she did his older brother. She often quote the Bible, said, let us love one to another. But though she prayed and though he cried, nothing ever was enough. She had no love for Franklin D. Scruff. Tell me will you wait and see Frank, you would have to admit, long after dark when he was ready to quit, he was just doggone tired of being alive. Well, sometimes he'd walk by the jewelry store late at night instead of pacing the floor. He'd stand there for hours just staring inside. Have the pretty jewels that reminded him of all the things denied to him. And sometimes when no one was looking, Frankie cried. Or maybe for fun But Frankie went and got himself a gun He'd stand there pistol in hand Hour upon hour Didn't know yet what to do with it Well all he knew was how he felt with it Holding that revolver Gave him a feeling of power Well, he walked right down to that jewelry store. He made up his mind, he kicked open the door. He pointed his gun right in that poor clerk's face. He said, give me the loot, said, give me the stuff. No time to be a hero, don't try to be tough. If you don't do what I say, I start shooting up the place. Frank had never used a revolver before It came from the street, he didn't buy it in the store So no one had taken the time just to explain How a hair trigger in shaky hands Could so quickly change your plans Just what a speeding bullet will do to a man's brain Are you still alone? Can you feel All the scars you've sown? They appointed a lawyer, took him to the judge They gave him his five minutes to explain He looked that judge right in the eye He opened his mouth and told his last lie He said, I meant to kill that clerk and I'd do it again Well, 
like he never knew just why he said it. All he knew was he didn't regret it. Soon he was staring down the barrels, waiting for release. Without a tear or a single sob, on his way to hell via firing squad, for the first time he could remember, Frankie fell to peace. Let me tell you a little story about Franklin D. Scruff. Times were pretty hard. Life was rough. He threw it all away for a shot at some shiny stuff. Say a prayer for Franklin D. Scruff.